The first message we have is, I thought I was over you. Wow, Divine Feminine, there's a masculine in your energy field who is sitting back and asking themselves, why can't I get over you? It seems like they're at a point in their life where they're being bombarded with your energy. It's as if it comes out of nowhere, stopping them in their tracks. It doesn't matter where they are or who they're with, your energy is almost haunting them at this stage of their life. This is particularly confusing for them because they were convinced they were over you. I'm not sure exactly what led to the lack of communication or the no contact period between you two, but it seems as though this person's entire demeanor has shifted. It's as if they've turned into a shell of themselves, guarding their heart space and navigating the world as though they weren't affected by this connection. If you've had any contact with this person, visually, through social media, or via shared friend groups, this masculine likely appeared completely unfazed by you. In fact, they seem to pride themselves on moving forward quickly and being unaffected by the connection. However, that's far from the truth. It's as though your person is now sitting back and realizing that the way they behaved stemmed from their belief that they were over you. Now, they're coming to terms with the fact that you still hold a powerful influence in their life, even though the two of you have not been physically or energetically connected for some time. They're beginning to ask themselves, why can't I get over you? This realization is catching them off guard, as they're now reacting to your energy in a way that's completely different from before. Perhaps your person came into contact with your energy in the past during the no contact period and didn't respond to it. But now, something is shifting. Their reaction to you has changed entirely. It seems they can no longer deny what they're feeling. This could serve as confirmation for you, Divine Feminine, because while this person acted as though your energy didn't face them, you always knew it did. They simply refused to give you the satisfaction of knowing how deeply the break or split affected them. Now, because your energy is reappearing in their life, they can no longer ignore it. It's unclear how this is manifesting for them, it could be through visual access to you, perhaps seeing you glowing in your radiant, poised, and happy state, taking care of yourself, and looking put together. This has likely had a significant impact on them. This might also be a situation where, in typical dynamics, the masculine quickly moves on after a split, appearing unfazed, while the feminine takes the time to go within, heal, and process. You may have been in this dynamic, but now something has shifted. It's catching up to your person, albeit long after the fact. If you're wondering how this masculine feels about you, know this, they genuinely believe they were over you. Their actions reflected that belief, but now your energy is hitting them out of nowhere. It's making them second-guess everything, their feelings, their decisions, and what unfolded after the no-contact period began. The next message we have is, time heals all wounds. I'm picking up on dual energy here and getting two distinct versions. Whether you know it or not, Divine Feminine, you and this Masculine have two completely different perspectives on what happened in your connection. So much so that if you were to sit down and have an open, honest discussion about everything, you'd both be shocked by how vastly your points of view differ. Divine Feminine, I'm sensing strong throat chakra energy with you. You are likely someone who is very assertive, able to speak your mind, and adept at conveying your emotions in a healthy and clear way. You were the person in the connection who was open and honest about where you stood, what you were feeling, and what you needed. Communication is vital to you, you value clarity and alignment, preferring to have everything laid out to avoid confusion or misalignment in your relationships. In contrast, the masculine in this connection seems to have been blocked at the throat chakra. They struggled to express their true emotions, intentions, and feelings. This lack of communication created a significant disconnect. You could feel when something was off, but your masculine rarely confirmed it or addressed the issues that weighed on your heart. They seemed unfazed by things that deeply affected you, which only deepened the gap between you. Now, 
However, it seems that all the things you said, all the issues you raised and the conversations you wanted to have, are finally catching up to them. This masculine may feel as though the no-contact period was necessary, as it provided them the space to reflect and face the communication gaps between you. Where you both stand now, I'm sensing a strong level of detachment. However, for you, Divine Feminine, this detachment feels healthy, a process you leaned into after giving all your energy to the connection. For your masculine, it's different. They seem to view the separation or no contact period as a form of detachment that's now helping them to understand your point of view. Your masculine suppress their emotions, believing the situation would resolve quickly. However, it didn't. They are now experiencing a delayed emotional response. The feelings they suppressed are surfacing, and they're finally processing the emotions they avoided during the initial stages of the split. This is why your energy feels so present to them now. They may be recalling the things you said, replaying conversations in their mind, and grappling with everything they ignored or dismissed. This emotional awakening could have a profound effect on your masculine. They might find themselves seeing your face when they close their eyes or experiencing repetitive thoughts and memories of you. This cyclical energy is hitting them hard because they tried so desperately to convince themselves that they were over you. But clearly, that was never the case. The final message we have is everyone was so wrong about you. If you're resonating with this message, Divine Feminine, you may have wondered why your person responded the way they did when your connection entered this no contact period. The answer lies in external influences, which are coming through very clearly here. Instead of communicating with you about their emotions, working through their feelings, or finding a solution together, your person turned to people in their immediate environment. This decision has proven to be a huge mistake for them because they are now realizing that everyone they confided in was wrong about you. It seems your person sought advice from people who didn't truly understand their feelings for you. As I mentioned before, there's a significant blockage in this masculine's throat chakra, which prevented them from expressing their emotions authentically. Not only were they not open with you about what you meant to them, but this lack of openness carried over even after the connection hit a pause. Your person wasn't honest with others about how deeply they felt for you, how much this connection affected them, or how difficult the separation truly was. Because of this, the advice they received didn't align with their true experience. It seems your masculine even downplayed their emotions, pretending to be unaffected. As a result, the responses and advice they got were based on a false narrative, one they had created themselves. This led them to exist in a kind of false reality, surrounded by people who were giving them guidance that didn't reflect the truth of your connection or who you are, Divine Feminine. Now, as their suppressed emotions resurface, they're starting to see the truth more clearly. They're realizing that the people they confided in didn't really understand your essence, the way you loved, the way you showed up in the relationship, or the depth of the masculine's feelings for you. This realization has hit them hard, as they begin to understand that the external opinions they relied on were completely off the mark. What might surprise you, Divine Feminine, is the fact that this masculine even confided in anyone at all. They may not seem like the type to open up about matters of the heart, yet this connection affected them so profoundly that it pushed them to seek support. This act of confiding, something they wouldn't normally do, shows just how deeply they were impacted. There's also an energy of repetition and cycles surrounding this connection. It feels like the two of you had a pattern of separating and coming back together. However, this time, things were different. Instead of returning to you, they turn to external sources for advice. These outside influences planted seeds of doubt or misjudgment in your masculine's mind, seeds that had nothing to do with who you truly are or how much you meant to them. Now, they're reflecting on this and realizing that everyone was wrong about you. But they also understand that the blame lies with them for not conveying your true essence to the people they sought guidance from. 
This external energy, whether it was family, friends, or others, cannot be blamed entirely, as they were only responding to the incomplete or inaccurate picture your masculine presented. As your energy finds its way back to your person, it's doing so in truth. It's showing up as a clear and authentic representation of who you truly are, and this truth is undeniable to them now. Ironically, it seems that it took this separation for them to finally recognize the depth and purity of your essence, and the mistakes they made in allowing external influences to cloud their perception. I thought I was over you, a masculine energy in your life, who once believed they had moved on, is now overwhelmed by your presence in their thoughts and energy. Despite acting indifferent during the no-contact period, they are now deeply affected, questioning why they can't let go. Their behavior of detachment was a facade, as they never fully processed their emotions. The delayed response to their feelings is now surfacing, forcing them to confront the truth of how much you still mean to them. Time heals all wounds, the connection between you and this masculine suffered from a significant communication gap. While you, Divine Feminine, expressed yourself openly and clearly, the Masculine suppressed their emotions, unable to convey their true feelings due to a throat chakra blockage. This led to misunderstandings and a lack of resolution. During the no-contact period, you embraced healthy detachment, while the Masculine is now only beginning to understand your perspective. Their suppressed emotions are hitting them hard, as they realize the depth of their unresolved feelings for you. Everyone was so wrong about you, external influences played a major role in how the masculine handled the connection. Instead of addressing their feelings with you, they sought advice from others, misrepresenting your essence and the depth of the connection. This led to misguided guidance from people who didn't understand you or the relationship. Now, the masculine recognizes that the opinions they relied on were wrong and that their lack of honesty caused this misunderstanding. Your energy is re-emerging in their life, presenting the truth of who you are, forcing them to reconcile with their mistakes and the reality of their emotions. Overall, the masculine, once disconnected and influenced by external opinions, is now overwhelmed by a resurgence of emotions and memories of the Divine Feminine. Suppression of their feelings and poor communication have led to delayed realizations about the depth of their connection with you. Now, they're beginning to see the truth, they were never over you, time hasn't healed their wounds, and others' opinions about you were entirely misguided. This awakening is prompting deep self-reflection on their part. If you don't forget, then write in the comments about how your day went, I will definitely read it. Thanks for watching guys, don't forget, like and subscribe channel.